It's working. Hopefully, it's working. Um, finishing off the SWR bridge, and it's um, it's been a while since I did that, and um, well, it's been a while since I went back to this tuner, and uh, I'm going to do it anyway. I hope you're all well. I don't know if there's anybody. Uh... No, no one. <laughs> But anyway, I'll put it together. I hope you're all good. Right, okay. Let's stick this thing on. Okay, no one's on the chat. I'm all alone. There must be football on or something. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, well, if anyone's interested, right. This is the SWR bridge. No, well, yeah, it's in focus. Little thing. Just soldering up the well, it's a bit, bit of pants in it. Just soldering up the um, the board. Now, a lot of people would tell you not to. Um, they would tell you not to solder, you know, bend the the pins back like this, just in case you've got to get the uh, the components off to do any work to them. And that's uh, that's probably good advice, but I don't mind. I'm just going to just do it because I don't have a a, um, a what they call it, like a PCB uh, rack. So let me show you that. I'm actually uh, just stuffing it in a pair of pliers. So I'm going to get this thing soldered up. Now I don't know if it, I won't be able to test it this evening. Bit of shame, but. Uh, uh, <laughs> Champions League. I don't even know what that is. All right. Anyway, hello, Terence. How you doing? Well, it's um, it's a convenient way of um, it's a convenient way of recording the uh, the, the video anyway. And I was going to do it, so I've just put some uh, music on it. Well, it's gone off now, and uh, I just thought, well, I'll just punch the live button and just see what happened. Um, but anyway, I don't know what the Champions League is. Sorry, strange one. Right now, then, what happened to the music? I'm sure there was some. Yeah. So there you go. Right. Now I don't know if you can see that. Get it in focus if I can. That, that will do.
find soldering these things up is very therapeutic. I'm determined to get it finished. Right, now then, snip some of these things off. I'll show you this. I managed to get the um, the toroid on. It was in a real pain in the backside. Just get that zoomed in a little bit. So let it go. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, it was a real pain in the backside getting that on there. Absolute pain. Um, yeah, uh, thanks Terence. No, it was a real pain to get that on. Each of those little loops went over the little tang on the back of that changeover switch. It works. It's pretty cool. Um, yeah, and I, I was going to video it, but unfortunately it took so... It was so difficult to do that and video at the same time I gave up. So I just thought, sod it, I'll get it done. But you can see it's a bit better there on the other camera. So... I might just nip some of these uh, these bad boys off. Um, if I can get it to come off, I've ruined the end of my pliers somehow. Don't know how. I would normally put. I've got Epidemic Sounds on there, but I normally would put them on for. I just listen to it, but I don't know how it works. I've never got the hang of epidemic. I was worried about getting a in, um, copyright strike or something. And I don't know if I can just play it. If anyone knows, if I can just play epidemic in the background while recording, whether I'll be all right. I mean, I do subscribe to them, so. Right, you little devils. Yeah, that's pretty much it, I think. That's that little board done. All by the shouting. Got a couple more joints just to do. didn't do is I didn't clean the board I should have done that still they'll do now I've not put the LED on this either uh, so that's the same focus I haven't got auto focus on this camera it comes up on the screen if I do it so Right, well that is done. Everything, man, let me just put it the other camera there. I've done everything bar the, the LED. So I've got the, I've got the changeover switch. Um, yeah, uh, get that in there. Sorry about this. That'll do. Right, yeah, I've got the changeover switch in there. I've got the little toroid on there. All the loading resistors. And, um, yeah, it's soldered up. So that's that part. Um, so in this little devil. This was a real pest. Um, when these went on, it, what I should have done is I should have cleaned these up prior to get, getting it on here. But I didn't. I managed to get it on, and then it was such a palaver. I decided to leave it and um, clean it up in situ with a scalpel, which, in hindsight, I shouldn't have done. But anyway, there you go. It's done now. Um, and the box itself. 
I've got to drill one more hole in the front for the switch to go through. But what I have realized is that if I drill it at the top, it's going to collide with this um, toroid. So I'm going to have to, I don't know what I'm going to have to do. I think that was the way it went round. So, is that going to go? Yeah. Um, I'm going to have to put it round that way and then drop the switch into the lower position so that it avoids the toroid and I think even then it's going to hit it it's going to get blooming close so I might have to turn this around and then that might just clear it inside in fact I think it will just well you can do that so there you go, pain in the neck, but hey ho. Um, this might let you have your no, no, not at all. Um, I, I've, um, I, I'm basically just uh, saving up the money, you know, just giving them a little bit when when a bit of cash comes my way, and uh, yeah, so it's it's all good. Otherwise, it's a big big uh, it's a big spend out, isn't it? But no, it's cool. I've got I've been playing with one today actually. I've been playing with the um, with the demo one. Um, it appears that um, it's quite difficult programming the the memories in that that radio from the front panel and um, it's not intuitive but it doesn't seem to be anyway um, it's like about three different layers of it and unusually the programming the um, that the memories in is is, is is mentioned in the advanced manual which is odd I think so the answer is no, I don't have it at the moment, but that's all right. I'm patient. I'll wait. So, uh, but yeah, right. Well, I haven't got anything else um, really to do on that. That was really, really quick. So I'm going to stick a fork in that. And um, as I say, I'll, I'll work out the next steps on this. Um, this has not been an easy kit to, to do. And it, in fact, to be honest with you, it's, it's so cheaply made in or sorry it's been so unthought out in it's when they sort of uh, packaged it and um, it's very difficult to to actually build um, it's so sort of all over the place so you've got a little bit of uh, you know fabrication engineering to do at the same time and not only have you got to put the kit together you've actually got to do quite a lot more um, and in some places you've actually got to fudge it you know things like the the knobs on the front um you know spacing them up with nuts and things like that a bit of super glue here and there yeah it's not it's not great and they also give you some washers and stuff which don't fit um on the uh, on the on the panel thing itself um very peculiar um the other thing is as well the quality of the actual changeover switch wasn't great so when you push the knob on it actually pushes the back off the switch so you end up with a pile of bits and trying to reassemble the switch so that slows you down um, the little um, the little capacitors on the back are not the best quality so all in all it's yeah it's been it's one of those kits that I kind of um, I wish I hadn't sort of started in in that way I, I, I think in hindsight if I did it again I would do it slightly differently um, that's nice though. That seems to to work out all right. Hopefully it will work. The little SWR bridge. Um, but like I said, I've made them before. I made them from scratch, and that one is made from scratch. Um, show you that one a bit more close up. Um, yeah. So, like I said before, that that come from a, a friend of mine who, who these are like really simple to to build, and all that's inside that is one of these polycons and 65 foot of wire on that and it's brilliant works a treat anyway i'm going to go um obviously there's football on so uh, i'm going to leave it there so th thanks everyone for um, saying hello and um, i'll leave that one up hopefully it'll it'll get some uh, views after um but anyway thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe see you soon bye